guess who's back? Back again. Scott is back. Tell her friends. Hello everyone, it's Scott and Movie Quick back again with another video and it has been a while since I've last said that. It's, it feels like forever to be honest. Uh, I think it's been about two months or so or nearly two months but it feels like a lot longer to be fair. But um, I just want to say a massive, massive thank you to everyone who has um, continued to support me and, you know, um, been concerned and asking me how, my, how I'm doing as well and asking me how my bike's been. I really, really do appreciate it. It really means a lot to me. Honestly, thank you so much, everyone. And um, even though I've took a break from YouTube, I'm um, watching loads of football films. Um, well, actually, not many films, to be fair, but I, I do want to get back on films. But listening to loads of records, been gaming as well, been doing a lot of other stuff. Um, I have still been watching people's videos um, and um, yeah, loads of people that I um, respect and follow on YouTube still uh, are bringing out absolutely amazing content, brilliant videos. Um, keep smashing it guys, honestly, you're all doing amazing content and um, yeah, just keep up the great work everyone because you're all absolutely fantastic. And um, yeah, before, before I get into today's topic of video itself, I just want to quickly say what's going to be happening with channel and stuff like that and um yeah well, I'm actually not too sure to be honest um I don't think the live streams are going to come back anytime soon that's um for sure um and I, I don't think I'll be uploading as frequently as I used to either but um if there is a time where I do have an idea for a certain video I'll just go for it and upload it um but yeah, I'm not going to upload just for the sake of it like I used to because I don't want it to become a chore. I want it to be fun and exciting and enjoy myself on YouTube. And uh, yeah, today, that's actually what I'm doing today. Just um, woke up up today, had an idea in my head. I was thinking it through in my head and um, I thought I really want to upload this because this is I think this is going to be a cool video. So um, And it's, it's great to be back. It really, really is. And I'm excited to make this video for you you all and I hope you all enjoy watching as well of course and again thank you all so much for kind words and support everyone it really does mean a lot and um yeah it's great to be back on YouTube but yeah um please don't expect videos to be as frequent as they used to be because they, they probably won't be to be fair but if there is a time where I do feel like making a video I will 100% make a video and if I ever do feel like bringing the night streams back at some point in the future, I will obviously bring them back as well. But for the time being, the night streams are unfortunately done for now, which is a shame. But again, thank you everyone for your support. But let's get cracking and get into this video, shall we? So in this video, I'm going to be talking about um, certain scenes or clips from um, films and music videos that used to scare me when I was a kid. So yep, yeah, it's going to be an interesting one and let's just get started. So um, first up, I'd like to talk about um, a film called Return of the Living Dead, a zombie comedy horror film from the mid-80s. I do have this on Blu-ray somewhere, but I'm not too sure where it is and I can't find it. So I'm just going to talk about the film. And the one scene that used to scare me in particular was the scene where um, Tina's walking around in the apartment. She's by herself and uh, she opens the door and the um, camera just zooms in on her and... Um, it has that creepy, tense, fast music and she has that obviously shocked expression when she first sees Tom and a zombie. That whole scene is just used to terrify me as a kid. And, um, yeah, well, I haven't actually, actually um, seen it properly in a while, so um, I'm sure I'll be all right now, but obviously I'm a lot older, so I'm sure I'll be watching it and it'll be an absolute piece of piss now, to be fair. But... um. Yeah, but I, I, I used to always cover my eyes up and uh, nine times out of ten I used to actually get it spot on in the time in that scene. But there was one time where I um, covered my eyes for art oh, safe now and then it, it got to that actual scene and um, I had my eyes up fully wide open. I was just like, oh, bollocks. And when I saw that scene, I absolutely shit myself, mate. I, yeah, that was one time I messed up during that scene. But, um, yeah, great film and a great scene. Second up, I'm going to talk about a music video. And this is going to be a music video to my favourite rap song of all time, 
Crossroads by Brain Thugs and Omni. And yeah, this video is just creepy, it's mysterious, it is um depressing is the right word to use for it, to be honest. There's um this creepy guy uh, walks around with that on this people come back from a dead in this video, there's um ghosts of people come back and this guy has this like massive wings at the end of the video like this angel sort of thing. It's just like what the actual fuck is going on here? But I love it. It is great. It fits the tone of the song very well as well. But there's one part of the song in particular that really, really used to creep me out and still does to this day. It's the scene where this um guy with a hat, he's the angel um type of guy, he sort of walks up, it's it's the first time you see him with his hat off with his jacket, and it's just such a creepy part of the um music video. And he sort of walks off, walks up to this guy, sort of points his finger towards him, and then this guy just has this um heart heart attack, he's having a heart attack, he's and it's the way his eyes sort of like roll back, it's just oh it's absolutely horrific to watch. It is awful. And there was one time where I actually messed up again. I used to have a computer in this room, don't have it anymore because obviously um got a lot more stuff in here now, but there's one time where I used to I used to kneel behind the chair and sort of like creep underneath when that see scene of the music video I used to come on and there was one time where I um crept up at the wrong time and it was at that specific moment of a music video and I was like bollocks I was like fuck's sake I, and again I shit myself and I actually fell forward off a chair as well it was hilarious but thankfully I didn't hurt, hurt myself at the time but yeah that's oh that is so creepy it is awful to watch it is nasty really horrific watching but a great music video and a great song and um, next up, I'd like to talk about another film, and that is The Shining on 4K. Yeah, still need to watch with 4K this, actually, but I have seen it on 4K. I think my dad had it. I watched it. Um, it's transferred, but I really wanted to get a 4K of it myself. And, yeah, still need to uh, watch my copy of it. And, um, yeah, love this film. And definitely looking forward to giving it a watch at some point. <coughs> Sorry about that, everyone. Um, just needed a quick cough there. But, um, yeah, great film, really creepy. My introduction to a sign Shining was actually um through my uncle, Steve, if you're watching. Hope you're doing well, mate. He had a poster up on his wall um, and it was the iconic photo when he had um, Jack Torrance as we um, act through the door and he says, here's Johnny. Yeah, it was that um iconic scene, which is what a poster that is, by the way. And... um. When I first um saw um Jack Torrance, um Jack Nicholson as Jack Torrance in a film, it was I think it was an advertisement on I think it was one of the ITV channels. And um yeah, it crept it absolutely used to creep me out. It was really scary. And I used to run up the stairs and I was like, I ain't going downstairs till that evil fucker goes off the screen, mate, and I wouldn't go downstairs at all, he's off the screen, so yeah. Um, number three is going to be Jack Torrance, Jack Nicholson. What a performance. And yeah, you just creep me out. And next up is going to be another music video. Now, this song I absolutely despise. I hate it. It is awful. And the music video is shit. And it's going to be a blue double D double da by Eiffel 65. Now, this used to give me nightmares when I was a kid because I hated the music video so much. I, those little blue aliens, I hate them. I hate them. And also, I hate the sci-fi setting, just the, everything about it. It's awful. I hate the slow motion running scenes. The song is shit as well. Just everything about it is awful. I don't want to hear the song or see that music video ever again in my life. It is absolute dog shit mate and um yeah had to make this list because it did actually used to appear in some of my nightmares when i was younger i'm not going to lie and i hate it next up it's going to be talking about another song that used to appear in some of my nightmares and um whilst i feel 65 buddha buddy is probably my most hated song ever this is my most hated music video of all time and it is going to be Heaven by G.J. Sammy. Oh, my God. 
I hate this music video with an absolute passion. I hate the look of it. I hate the atmosphere. Obviously, it's supposed to be set in heaven. Just, it makes me feel ill. It makes me feel sick to my stomach whenever I see the video. I, I hate it. It looks awful. Um, it creeps me out. And um, the song itself is shit as well. And also, it's featuring Yanu and Do. I know what they can do is fuck off because the song is shit. I mean, Yanu and Do, what we fuck? What they... But yeah, it is awful. I hate it again. Don't want to hear the song ever again and don't want to see the music video ever again. It is, again, absolute dog shit, mate. I hate it with passion. Next up, I'm going to be talking about something I actually enjoy and it is going to be the original David Dead. Love this film. One of my favourite zombie films of all time. And um, the scene I'm going to be talking about is right at the very start, obviously, the jump scare start. Which a little bit cheating because I didn't actually watch it properly until I got older. I was always too scared to watch it. Um, I was told about the scene, and when I heard the tense music at the start and saw the um obviously the big wall and the candle on the front of it, I was just like, nope. Forward it to the next scene or the scene ahead of that. So I'd always forward it to the next scene when I was younger, and it wasn't until I got older when I had finally had the balls to watch it. I mean, I was still tensing up, covering my ears and stuff. But when I, when I finally watched it, I was like, OK, it wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. But, yeah, when I was younger, I just did not want to watch that scene at all. And, um, yeah, it was creepy just the thought of it. Like, nah, no chance. But loved the film. Absolutely love it. And um, now when I watch that scene, I could watch it like a piece of piss, mate. It is, yeah, absolutely no problems at all watching it now. But back then, no, no, no. Next up, and the final film I'm going to be talking about today is the original Dawn of the Dead, my favourite film of all time. Absolutely love it. And um, the scene I'm going to be talking about is probably not too scary, but bearing in mind, I was only three years old at the time when I first watched it. The rest of the film was fine, didn't bother me, until it got up to that one scene when Roger... Um, turns into a zombie and he moves his eyes around like this and I was just like no 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 I am done and I, I, I it was getting quite late in the evening I remember as well and I was just like oh, I'll finish it tomorrow and the rest of the film when I finished it absolutely fine didn't have a problem with the rest of it just that one scene and um yeah again I could watch it like a piece of piss now but back then no mate just no no chance but what a film what um a scene and yeah that scene just creeped me out when I was younger but there we have it everyone I hope you've all enjoyed this video and um, don't forget to leave a like and comment down below that would be very much appreciated thank you all so much everyone and uh, again thank you all for continued support I know it's been a while since I've done a video but I hope you all enjoyed and again thank you all so much I really do appreciate it and um, yeah just thought of this idea this morning of talking through it my head I was like I'm gonna do it because why not <laughs> i just thought let's do it because why not mate and um yeah i'm so glad i've done this video because i had an absolute blast making that and i hope you all enjoyed watching as well everyone and let me know what scenes of music videos or you know films that used to scare you when you were younger i'd love to hear your thoughts that'd be very much appreciated thank you all so much everyone and that'd be it for this video everyone take care everyone and I'll see you all later.